usually on any given school day, Montclair State University, which is the second largest university in New Jersey, would be full with its over 20,000 students. Although the campus has been mostly empty for over a year now, this will change next month, where multiple graduation ceremonies will be held over a week. This is a rare occurrence this year due to the COVID pandemic, and multiple students are unhappy about their school's plans. Mina Versa, 21, prepares to graduate from the University of San Francisco in May, but she is currently not satisfied with the experience that is going to occur during her graduation. I think graduating during a pandemic is kind of a bad experience because you don't really get to see everyone in person and it doesn't really feel like an actual graduation. It feels more like I'm just finishing another semester. I wish I could graduate in person and like celebrate with all my friends and see my professors in person and be on campus and have that real experience that I know my sisters had. Interested in marketing, fashion, and social media, Nina is now figuring out what to do when she officially graduates next month. I'm looking for jobs right now. I was considering grad school, but again, I don't really see myself doing virtual school, so that's probably an option later on if I do want to go back to school. Nicole Mora, 21, is graduating from Rutgers University with a major in healthcare administration this month, and her school is also planning a virtual ceremony. Of course, she is unhappy about this, but she is thankful that she knew all along. I feel upset about it, but at least my school advised us at the beginning of the year that this, were th that this was the plan, so we didn't really have much hope of anything else so we like knew this was happening although the pandemic has altered her actual graduation nicole mora still has a concrete plan of what she plans to do once fully graduating from rutgers um i'm still gonna attend hopefully a nursing program after graduation most graduations may be virtual but college graduates are planning to take advantage of their campuses to take photos i have to take out the time to just drive down to campus tomorrow to take pictures um, around campus in my graduation gown. Most importantly, after three rough semesters, all of the graduates that I've spoken to are just happy that they're safe, healthy, and finished with this chapter.